you don't want to use strategist and you're listening to and or watching us on YouTube to Latinos in Real Estate Investing Podcast. And today's episode, I want to talk about why real estate is a good investment and my thoughts on why I think it's better than most investments out there. This is just my personal opinion. So I'm going to get right into it. I had a mentor once and we're having lunch one day. She still is one of the, the, the biggest real estate investor I know up to date. And one day we're having lunch and I said, hey, why real estate? Why do you, why do you like real estate? And she says to me, the reason I like real estate is because it's a physical asset, right? It's a hard physical asset. I can literally go walk up to someone's doorstep, knock on the door and exchange dollars or whatever. And I thought about that and I was like, wow, that's pretty strong, right? Which leads me to the first point of why I think real estate is a good investment. And number one is it creates cash flow. If done right, it's an asset that produces cash for you. So during the pandemic, my roof in my personal house was shot. This was in April of 2020. My wife and I decided, hey, our contractors are doing nothing right now. Prices are down, right? Things were deflating at that time because there was no one was buying anything. And we thought, hey, we call our contractor to come and do our roof. So we did. That roof cost me at my cost, $10,000 with material and labor. And when you think about that house where I live in is not an asset. I, I wanna make sure that that's clear. For me, my home where I live and my family lives, it's not an asset for us. Actually, it is our biggest liability, right? Because you think about that roof, the money to repair that roof in the house I live in where did that money have to come from? That money had to come from A, my savings, B, my, if I had a job, my job, my business, it had to come from someplace else. Our most middle class Americans are just working, are, are working class people that have a job and they have to go work to then pay for this thing. So if something is taking money out of your pocket, then it's considered a liability. If something is putting money in your pocket, then it's considered an asset. So the fact that I had to take money out of my pocket and put it into this roof that's not producing an income, and some may argue that that is producing shelter for me and my family, and yes it is, it's, it's a must, I get it, we all need that, and, and I have to put money from someplace else to cover that, then that becomes a liability. However, real estate, when done correctly, now, if that same house I lived in, now I was renting the basement or I was renting rooms or it was an Airbnb, now that house switches from a liability to an asset because now it's producing some income and it's producing money, putting money into my pocket. I'm gonna make a book recommendation here if I think about this because in The Richest Men in Babylon, it's a, it's a great book, they talk about this and, and how put money to work for you and make you money. So when you have enough of these assets, enough of these houses now, now you have enough cash flow coming in net net after your expenses to cover your living expenses with your family and the minute that those assets are producing one dollar over your expenses at home, you my friend are officially what we call financially free. Number two is it appreciates over time. Real estate, there's a saying is don't wait to buy real estate, buy real estate and wait, but buy right. And the, and the point of that statement is that real estate always appreciates over time. Over time, you look at it, it might have some ups and downs, but over time it's an upward trajectory. Number three, it is a hedge against inflation and we're seeing that currently as we're seeing inflation go up, but what is also happening is that the prices of housing is going up and the prices of rent have gone up to the roof. Year over year, we were at 14% increase nationwide in terms of rent. So if you had assets that you were renting that were producing money for you, your asset went up, your income would have gone up by 14%. Now, inflation as of March 2022 
was 8.5 percent and if you had a rent increase of 14 percent guess who's up you're up everything else went up with that house your, your insurance your maybe your taxes maybe so a lot of things went up your cost of water went up all that stuff went up but you also beat inflation because if, if it went up by 8.5 percent you increased it by 14 percent uh six percent you're up ahead on inflation by six percent number four it's a basic human need everyone needs a place to live uh, Jeff Bezos, Elon Musk, those guys haven't figured out yet on how to get a human being to use a toilet online, right? They haven't figured that out. I can't see that for a long time or how to store people's physical things online. I think we're far from that right now. And number five, it's how I started. It's a hard physical asset. You can see it. You can touch it. You can knock on the door. You can say, hey, thank you for staying in my place. It is now time for you to pay me for staying here and if you can't pay me for staying here i have to ask you to leave and so i can put someone else in this piece of land that can stay here and pay me for it and that my friends is why real estate is a good investment in my opinion thank you guys for watching thank you guys for listening i would appreciate it if you just subscribe down there please give us a thumbs up and give me your thoughts on what other reasons there are to invest in real estate why is real estate a good investment i'd like to hear your, your thoughts on that right why do you not think that real estate is a good investment that's cool too let's talk about that drop it in the comments peace out thanks for watching y'all so guys if you like this video you just watch click on this video up here and it might be something you might like and guys i really appreciate you guys watching remember to like and subscribe our channel really appreciate it thank you very much peace out